Good evening, Tallahassee. Currently on campus, as we're recording this video, just after 6.30, 73 degrees here, mostly cloudy skies. That dew point, mighty sticky, 71 degree dew point. With a dew point that close to the temperature, it's very, very sticky. And across the rest of the Big Bend, we've got similar conditions at 73 degrees. Here in Tallahassee, we're also looking at 71 St. Mark's and Monticello. And temperatures right near that 70 degree mark for the entire Big Bend. Um, only getting down just to 69. Zooming out to the rest of the tri-state area, we are looking at some 80s as we get down towards Orlando. But 74 for Valdosta, 69 in Dothan. Some light showers up in Albany at 70 degrees. And it's only as we go further north and west, Montgomery and Meridian, that we start to see the sun's shining. Our satellite and radar, we got a lot of clouds. Um, most of them aren't too heavy clouds, so we are still getting some light through them while there is still a little bit of sunshine left to the day. The big thing, though, is that we saw some rain today. We had those showers coming through the area Friday earlier this afternoon. As you take a look at this time stamp here, uh, when we get towards that 3 and 4 o'clock hour, there's that rain that came through this afternoon, and it gave us a good third of an inch here in Tallahassee, that 0.37 inches, just over a third of an inch. Apalachicola, they got all the way up to a half an inch, and then Wilma got over a half an inch at six-tenths of an inch. So we are getting some well-needed rain. We just got out of um, the drought that we were in last fall, and we barely saw any rain for the last three months of 2016. If you've got any beach plans for the weekend, might want to rethink that because we got those winds out of the south, 15 to 20 miles an hour with the storms that we're expecting to see. So not the best day to go to the beach. If you do have um, beach plans that you just have to get out there and you find a break in the storms, maybe stick to flying a kite instead of getting in the water. And as always, lather on the sunscreen. We still have a high UV index of 8. If you plan on taking out a boat, be very careful. And I'd only recommend that if you're a very experienced boater and you've got a reason to be out there, because the waves are going to be four to six feet, choppy waters, and we do have those showers and storms possible. So please exercise caution out at the beach tomorrow. For the Big Bend tonight, we're looking at temperatures right around 64 degrees. Perry, St. Mark's, Monticello, Thomasville, all of us looking at 64 degrees. Big story, that 50% chance of rain is going to increase throughout the evening. So if you have any evening plans, bring your umbrella on because there will be hit and miss showers across the entire Big Bend. Tomorrow, that 80% chance of rain, we are looking at up to an inch of rain, so you definitely want the umbrella and the rain boots as you head out tomorrow. And please be careful on the wet roads. Wet roads can make the driving conditions more dangerous. But for the Big Bend, we're looking at temperatures around 75 degrees, Perry and Valdosta, as well as Tallahassee here, 75 degrees. The week ahead, once the rain clears out Monday morning, 42 degrees, and we still got a couple uh, showers potentially lingering around, but we are cooling down. We don't get back to the 70s till Wednesday, and then right after we hit 70 degrees, cools off again. Thursday morning low, 42 degrees again, and we do see some rain chances for the end of the week. Have a nice weekend, Tallahassee.